Talk. Hey, Ryan, it's Eric. Oh, hey, Cassie. Please don't call me that. Mmm. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Anyway, I was just calling to see how things were going with the next episode of Pimp Your Production. I haven't heard from you in forever. Oh, man, it's going so well. We're going on it right now. Oh, really? Yeah. Typing away, making a script of golden words to bring justice to your angelic gearsonal. You hear me typing? That's it. I was just calling because I want you to know I want this last episode to be really big. I want it to go out in a real bang, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, coach. With that in mind, I want to raise the budget. Money? Yeah. Money's good. Anything you guys need, you just tell me it's yours. Within reason, of course. Of course, but yeah, you should just give me your credit card. What? You're a busy man, Kessie baby. I don't want to bug you every time I need staples for the office. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah, I feel you. You just trust it over my way. I'll get it done. I guess it'll be okay. It, it'll just need to stay reasonable. Of course. Just a bit extra. This ain't Hollywood. <laughs> hey, you listen to me, Kessie baby boo. You don't got a thing to worry about. Okay? I'm sure I don't, but I know how you can get. Okay, can't hear you no more. Bye. Pop, pop, bang. special episode of Pippi Productions. I'm Ryan Conley, and today we're gonna do two things. One, whatever pops into my head, and two, talk about the Ketzer Crane Revolution Head, which I kinda like to think of as a robotic camera butler from the future. What's the Revolution Head, you may ask? What is my response? Slap yourself in the face until your mother cries. In short, the Revolution Head is a motorized pan and tilt camera control system. That's right, this baby gives you 360 degrees of both pan and tilt. Other tech specs you should fill your jelly bellies with is how this little monster is made of aluminum with a stainless steel hardware construction. It has dual motors, one for each access, giving you zero backlash and 100% holding power. It also pimps balls, ball bearings that is, and a belt drive to eliminate gear to gear noise. And it only weighs about 10 pounds with a weight capacity of 20 pounds. Now all that talk about aluminum made me think of something I've always wanted to buy. Josh! What? Come here! Open my mask. Why? Open the mask! With its Hold it open! With its superior dynamic range, the Revolution head is both faster and slower than other heads at similar price ranges. And, with it being a Kessler product, this filmmaker's delight works perfectly along pretty much all other Kessler gear like the Cine Slider, the Pocket Dolly, the Pocket Jib, the Shuttle Pod, the Hercules Head, and of course, the Kessler Crank. And the best part of these little pieces of robot porn are the fact that they're controlled by the Oracle system, which means, as we showed you on another episode, you can program your shot in and have the Revolution Head repeat that shot perfectly over and over. Plus, you're getting your hands away from the machine and onto some controls, which means you're gonna get a much more smooth and professional shot. One of the biggest factors for me are the advanced visual effects that you can pull off all thanks to this bad boy. As we showed you in another episode, you can do multiple passes of one shot to pull off a really dynamic VFX shot, but now you add the revolution head into the mix and you get more degrees of movement and total mind effery. Grab the piece of wood. Why? Grab it! Now, hit me! Are you sure? 
Bro, it's a suit of armor. It's a really expensive suit, though. What do you care? It's not your money. Hit me, pansy! Okay. The website lied. That hurt like a mother freaker. What do I do? Uh, let's just go to the party. <laughs> let's just go to the party. It's okay, buddy. It's okay. Oh my god. Hi, honey. Wait, 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 slow down. That's, that's not possible. I have a hundred times that in my account. They cut up the card. That's unacceptable. I have an ass load of money. I'm Eric Kessler. I'm really sorry, dear. I have no idea why the money's... Conley. I'll call you back. Yes. That's awesome. Awesome. I will see you there. Guys, we're blowing up a seven-story building in three hours. Get dressed. The back door. Kessie, baby? I told you not to call me that. Don't mess with Kessler. Bitches. <laughs> <laughs>